In this presentation, we're going to be looking at how we can use Maya's joint tool to symmetrically draw joints down the character's arms, as well as have those joints be automatically projected to the center of the volume they're being drawn within. Let's bring up the options for the joint tool and make sure that we have symmetry turned on, the x-axis. We can switch to our top view, enable the display of our joints, and turn on the snap to project option. So with the snap to project option turned on, Maya is going to automatically handle finding the center volume of the, of the object that we're drawing inside of. So it's going to be taking care of the basically the Y placement of these joints. If I'm taking care of the X and Z in the top view, Maya is going to be handling positioning those, those joints in the Y axis automatically for me inside the center of the volume that they're being drawn on top of. So we'll just add an extra bone into that thumb and we can switch over to our perspective. And you can see that Maya's done a really good job of finding the center volume. So to finish this guy off, what we'll do is we'll just parent it into this existing rig. One of the other things that's really nice about the symmetry tool inside of Maya is it's a live connection. So if I want to start modifying the joint, obviously on the left side, the right side's going to automatically match that position. So let's just finish this off by quickly binding this up using the smooth bind with heat option turned on so that's going to automatically handle all the nice little areas around the fingers for us. So this is a simple example but I hope it really illustrates the power of using the joint symmetry tool in conjunction with the projected snap to very quickly start generating complex rigs inside of Maya.